sleep, I promise you. Look, leg, lift. We want to look in the direction that we want to go. If we want to go to the right, we're going to turn our head, our neck, our shoulders. We're going to do a twist of our bodies. Now what happens is people get this down and go, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. And they just lift up their eyes. That's really cute if you're on him. But most of these guys go, what? They want you to be clear. And looking with your eyes or just the tip of your head is not clear to a ranch horse. You're going to look where you want to go. As you're looking where you want to go, you're going to do a thing called toe out heel, and you're going to roll with your calf, opposite calf, into the horse. That rolling motion where you make contact with them, that's called the calf. Now, as you twist and roll, you're doing a thing called a seat cue. Okay? It actually puts your hips in the right alignment to help drive the horse in the direction that you want to go. So you're looking. You're legging the horse, and then you lift. As you look and you leg, you kind of do this almost all at the same time. It's like a half beat. Look, leg, lift. As you're looking and you're legging, you're also going to be lifting one rein up. One rein, whatever hand goes up, the other hand stays low. We don't bring them up together. We're not riding on a Harley. We're going to keep our hand low, okay? I love riding Harleys, but this doesn't work on horses. You pick your hand up, point your thumb up, and then take your pinky. Here's the trick. Everybody does this to point their pinky. I'm not quite sure why. Point it out in the direction you want to go. If you're looking that way, lift, point. What's going to happen is you're going to make a triangle with your reins. The, from the ear to the shoulder is a line. From the mouth to your hand is a line. You're going to see a triangle. That triangle, the angles are helping. This is a technique called direct and drive. Direct and drive. We're directing the horse where we want to go with our reins and our looking and our body posture. We're driving them with our heels. When we want to go forward, we squeeze with both legs. When we want to stop, we squeeze with our knees, sit back on our pockets, lift our reins up. We're going to talk about all that.